This is an instructional video detailing the applications and functions of the Phase II UTG-1500 ultrasonic thickness gauge. The UTG-1500 is designed to test metallic and non-metallic materials as long as they have parallel top and bottom surfaces and sound waves can travel through the material. The technology incorporated utilizes a simple ultrasonic dual element transducer that transmits and receives sound waves. Generally, velocity of sound through the material to be tested is a known value and usually supplied via chart in the manual. In case of the UTG-1500, we have preset some general material velocities for your convenience. You always have the option to manually preset the velocity of any material. Each gauge is supplied with a 5 MHz dual sensor probe, bottle of coupling gel, four AAA batteries, and carry case. Now let's move over to operation of the UTG-1500 and see how easy it is to utilize the different functions, taking tests, and obtaining results. To begin, insert the plugs of the transducer into either of the plugs in the gauge. Press the power button to bring up the interface. The inch metric button on the top right will allow you to toggle between inch or metric readings. This will also determine the velocity setting reading in inch or metric as well. The select button in the center of the keypad allows you to select the material to be tested, either for automatic velocity setting or for manual setting in code 12. Use the plus or minus arrow buttons to scroll up or down in the menu. The velocity button will allow you to enter the velocity setting during a manual setup. The cal key is for calibration. The gauge has a built-in calibration block on the bottom surface of the gauge. The thickness of this block is 5 mm or 197 thousandths. Place a small drop of coupling gel on the calibration block. Press the calibration key and cal will flash on the display. Press the probe flat on the calibration block, making sure the coupling indicator appears on the display. The reading should be 5 mm or 197 thousandths. This will flash with the cal while still holding the probe to the block. Press cal again to save. Remove probe from block. Now press the probe to the calibration block once again to confirm the reading is 197 thousandths or 5 mm. The calibration result will automatically be saved once confirmed. Now that the unit is calibrated, you can begin to test your material. Make certain to select the material code, add gel to your workpiece, and press the probe to your surface. Don't forget, if you have other material than the preset codes, you can enter CD12 and manually enter the correct sound velocity for your material. This can be referenced from the chart provided in the manual. This concludes our application and function guide for the Phase II UTG-1500 ultrasonic thickness gauge. Should you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact us at 201-962-7373.